story of Tom Jeffers, Indian agent, and his blood brother, Cochise, greatest Apache chief. Two men from different worlds who fought side by side to change the history of the Southwest. They were only Apaches. They were human beings. They didn't even have weapons to protect themselves. So what? I'm not ashamed of ordering the attack. I'm only sorry some of them escaped. Cheer up. None of the women and children escaped. An Apache is an Apache. You Indian lovers forget how they killed and tortured decent white people. Take him to the guardhouse, Sergeant. None at large. You haven't heard the end of this, Colonel. None as old. Maybe. He's an Apache chief. There'll be plenty of blood spilled on his trail. Jeffords isn't there some way to bring him in without fighting. There's one man who might make Nana listen. One of the few men who could even trail Nana. Cochise. He listened to you, Jeffords. Maybe. Won't be easy for Cochise to lead the soldiers after his father's best friend. I think Colonel Horn will do everything he can to avoid fighting Nana. Will he, my brother? He gave you his word. The last Cochise has changed. He tested it a little. It was tested. He spoke truth, even when he thought it would cost him my help. Colonel, they butchered some cows, made jerky. Made off with the horses. About ten. Ten? No cowpuncher keeps ten horses at a line shack. Are you sure, Cochise? The sign is on the earth. All I said Colonel, was... Apaches learned to read sign as they learned to walk. Well, Jesus insulted because he felt you were doubting his word. Well, tell him not to be so blasted sensitive. I wouldn't insult him. He knows that, Colonel. There's no man living who has insulted Cochise. Mm -hmm. 